<sighs> I already know one to two years down the line. I'm gonna watch this video and cringe hella hard. Okay, thank you, car driving by, ruining my damn intro. What's up, guys? It's me, Sam Poppy Rick. Finally, the day has come where I can start making my own content. And I am ecstatic. I'm. It's overwhelming to think that this day has came. And. I just want to thank every single person that helped me along the way to get to me, get me to the point I am right now. But in today's video, I want to talk about three different subjects. First one is going to be basically introducing myself. Topic number two is going to be um, the ideas for my channel and for the future of my channel. And then number two, three is going to be a little more in-depth background of myself and my life and goals I want to achieve with this channel. So starting with subject one, my name is Poppy Rick. I love anime, I love food, I love video games, I love Pokemon, I love food, and I just love making people happy and also as well make them laugh. That's one of my driven things to do in life is to feel people to make and to make people feel welcome. And you are going to have me stutter here and there because I'm nervous <laughs> because I never recorded before and I got to get used to this. So I might stagger over my words. I might stutter I might say things wrong or pronounce things differently because I'm trying to get comfortable with this being a part of my life so that's some things about me that I I love watching Grizzly I love watching you wow yeah my idea um I love watching Grizzly. I love Richard. Uh, what, Richard. I love watching Blarg. I love watching Home Wrecker, and those are the three main people that maybe do what, I, what I'm doing today. Those are the inspiration I have of why I'm doing this today, and as well as actually finding people to talk to and you know, making friends with. That's one great big goal I have. And the fact that I can make friends, it's, you know, it seems so far, it seems so far-fetched. It seems so far-fetched, and it's actually a reality. And how long does fire last? Recruit KSM Ubu. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, okay. Alright, but. The goals of my channel, basically, I want, what I want to do with it is I want to play Siri based games. Basically, Metal Gear, Resident Evil, Kingdom Hearts, the Pokemon games. Um, God of War, and I want to play them from start to finish. I'm also trying to find a group that I could make content with. The friends who I have that I could say our sense of humor is either on par with the Streamers crew or could be a little bit more darker than their sense of humor. At the moment, they don't have any mics or equipment to, you know, make content with me. So down the line, hopefully, I can have my friends. I go half and half with them, get them the equipment they need, and 
we could push out the content you guys want. And then another thing we want to do is as well as vlog type game, uh, vlog type uh, videos. Uh, oh, wrong oh, thing. Is vlog type videos, as well as Pokemon card openings. And I, I still have other ideas I want to do as well, but everything is not too clear because I have to change areas. The space I have now can't really do the things I would like to do. So I will have to wait until you know future endeavors where I actually have enough you know, space to do the content I do want to do. Um So that's just parts of what this channel is gonna tell. And now on to basically um a little backstory myself. So, growing up, I probably could relate to a. I could probably relate to a big, big majority of y'all. Big majority of y'all who've probably been bullied, probably been ignored, probably been. Probably somewhere down here. We've probably been, you know, kind of like not mistreated anymore. We've probably been you no know, teased, bullied, and just felt outcasted. And I've been through that and it sucks from my elementary to middle school life. I always been I'm just outcasted. I think I'm just trying to find a better word to it, but it hurts. And especially when it comes to family wise too, I felt like I was a shadow in my family. I would try my best to succeed, try my best to get the best grades, try my best to do the best I can and then I would just get overshadowed by either siblings, cousins, uncles, and I just felt unwanted. And that's something that I want to bring to the channel as well in the sense where I don't want people to go through the stuff I've been through. My goal in life is to be the friend that I wish I had in my life. And no more in death. After, I would say close to the ending of middle school, I had to make a little rev uh, revelations and change all that from happening because I didn't want to enter high school going through the same thing, getting jumped, getting bullied, getting teased, having no friends. All that aspect I didn't want to go through that so I managed to swallow my pride and decide to be the friend that I wish I had and for the people who bullied me for the people who ignored me the people who teased me I swallowed my pride and hey I told them hey listen I know your grades are doing so well when it comes to math or for English let me help you He'll look at me like he 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 probably just seen that to say that. I'm like, no, I authentically mean it. I will help you. And little by little, I was helping everybody with their English uh, English um homeworks and the papers or math. Oh and I did all that and. They took a little realization that, yo, this, this dude is actually pretty cool. Why were we making fun of him? Why were we teasing him? And after a while, they just changed their 
perspective on who I was. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to sound whore right now. I'm here nowhere. Oh, okay. But, um, just to hurry this part up and go back to the main menu so I can talk a little bit more, guys. Talk to you guys more. But. I made friends for the people who tease me, and I managed to befriend them. And th they themselves apologize for the things they have done or said to me in the past. I'm not saying to take my advice to do that. The main part I'm trying to say is to be yourself. Being myself and swallowing my pride made me the f made I made the friends I made today because of it and I have I could have not gone this far without making that choice in my life what I want to do with this channel is that I want to help people who are going through this being bullied being teased feeling overshadowed feeling left out feeling outcasted and I want to give them a voice. I want to help them find their voice. And we could do that through laughter. We could do that through jokes. We could do that through just communicating. I have my Discord. I have my Twitter. I have my Instagram. All of them are under the same exact name as my YouTube channel. And I want to help people. I already made a podcast a month months ago with one of my close friends. And that's the main goal of that podcast is to help people who has lost their voice and searching for one. And like I said, this channel is going to be mostly dark humored, sometimes chill, just laid back and relaxing. But I am a dark dad joke. I had a co worker. To ask my other co-worker who happens to be Jewish hey did you clean my car or can you clean my car the guy looked at him like um I'm sorry Nazi people don't wash cars I heard that and for some <laughs> for some evil reason my brain triggered and I replied immediately for them I'm like yeah they don't they don't wash cars they gas them <laughs> my Jewish <laughs> co-worker looked at me and just with the Pikachu shock face and he, for like two seconds he just stared at me with his jaw dropped and he's like did you really just said that D -d did you just do that D did you just did that was a good joke it's messed up that's a good ass joke <laughs> If you guys are ready for comedy like that or dark humor like that, there's way worse things that's going to be said on this channel. So I hope you guys are ready for that. But other than that, this is the outro of my video. See you guys in the next video.